Good day everyone. This is Ranila Lisama Laksamana of Bagbag National High School. My research is all about the hurdles to cope with the lived experiences of Bagbag National High School senior high school teachers in teaching using modular distance learning. For the rationale, it came from the BELCP plan. Teachers have a very limited time to teach the students in this kind of learning modality. Monitoring the students' progress is a teacher's responsibility. The students learn on their own. MBM was still utilized during the transition period. The results of this study will lead to teaching interventions during the transition period, the, the, the its reflection and revisiting the MDL guidelines through the SAGS teach, teachers' experiences in teaching using modular distance learning. For the key literature, in light of COVID-19, Deputy Secretary Briones in 2020 unveiled the BELCP. Castro Verde and Acala 2021 presented difficulties faced by the teachers by looking at how they organize, prepare, and distribute modules, keep track of students' progress, examine and assess outputs, and give comments in students' performance. Moreover, Hidalgo 2022 found that in order to handle this learning modality, teachers in MDL execute a range of tasks, including creating and disseminating modules, monitoring learners' progress, and handling a lot of paperwork. Positively, some educators see the pandemic as an opportunity for educational advancement. For the methodology, I use phenomenological research design since I dealt with the teacher's experiences. I use purposive sampling. I conducted an interview and, and, I, and I analyzed the data based on suggested generic steps of Creswell 1998. For the findings and the challenges in the availability of teaching learning materials, one theme emerged, inadequacy of teaching learning materials. For the retrieval of formative and summative tasks, the following themes emerged. The overdue task challenge, the lethargic study habit challenge, the plagiarized output challenge. For the checking the formative of the formative and summative tasks, the plagiarized output challenge, the laborious scrutiny of outputs. And finally, for in giving feedback to the students, the struggles in distant feedback. For the findings in the coping strategies based on the challenges in the availability of teaching learning materials, the search for teaching learning materials, the online delivery and allocation of teaching learning materials via GC strategy, the holographic teaching learning material strategy, whereas teachers write their own modules. For the retrieval of formative and summative tasks, the following themes emerged. The tech savvy strategy, the wrap one's mind strategy, or the teacher's convincing power, the inappropriate persona strategy, or in-person meeting with the students. For the checking of the formative and summative tests, the there and then commentary strategy, the wrap one's mind around commentary strategy. In giving feedback to the students, the following themes emerge. DM is the key strategy, DM or call for an in-person meet strategy. For the teaching strategies based on the challenges, for the availability of teaching materials, maximizing the use of resources, for the retrieval of formative and summative tasks, maximizing the use of various platforms in communication, for the checking of formative and summative tasks, detailed feedbacking, giving feedback to the students, maximizing the use of various platforms in communication and involvement of parents in giving feedbacks. For the implication, DEPET needs to provide standard teaching learning materials appropriate for the context of situations in MDL. These challenges may be avoided in the continuous conduct of, or, of MDL or in ADMs. For the conclusion, SAGS teachers experience challenges in the following areas in their teaching fields. But all of them made use of scoping strategies in order to address these challenges, which, re which resulted to the teaching strategies in the conduct of MDL. For the recommendation, SAGS teachers, despite the restrictions and, lim and limitations brought by the pandemic, must maximize all their means in finding or crafting teaching learning materials, in retrieving the assigned tasks given to the students, involve the parents in learning, retrieving of output and feedbacking. They must possess patience and deep understanding in checking the outputs of the students. Immediate feedback is necessary in MDL. Bagbag SHS teachers who are handling irregular students may adopt or adopt the, that proposed teaching strategies. For the references, 
Thank you very much. Have a great day.